But well, hindsight's twenty twenty though. Like, are you not going to pay McCaffrey right now? Like, like we're we're looking at the basically the same trajectory of like strong rookie season gets a little bit better, meteoric type of rise, best in the league conversation. Like, are you not paying Christian McCaffrey? I mean, he's talking about holding out right now, and his team is not going to be competitive. So, you know, they could stand to have him hold out because if he holds out, it actually does them a favor, helps them with their draft, you know, picks. But if you're talking about a team who's trying to win, how can you not play pay the best player on your team and arguably one of the best players in the league? Like, I, th- I think it just worked out that way that he got hurt. But, like, are you seriously not going to pay but, McCaffrey? But you could do the, the Le'Veon Bell, drag him out for a couple of years, Get what you need out of it and this hey this this league's not built for running back contracts. Go yeah. find another guy. But cause when when do we think that the Panthers in their timeline think they're gonna be ready to win? Not soon and, and yeah, so, not so. so you yeah. drag him out as, as one of those guys. If he continues to play well, he's he's gonna age well in the league. Mm-hmm. He's a he's a good receiving back. He, right. he should have a long career, uh you know, not not talking about injuries or anything. But he could drag that out into six seven with the uh, the tag. If they don't like it, just let him go. Yeah. Or you ta- you you finish him with you know give him a lifetime deal because yeah, you know make it a little longer, save some money somewhere, and hopefully when you're competitive, he's still playing. 